everybody. So today in honor of the um, blind box that we're opening today, I did pull out my 200% Laura right there because we are opening the newest uh, Laura No Fairy Tales by Toy City. So this series has nine boxes in total. Um, typically Laura does have 12, but um, sometimes she will have like nine. So this is what we have. Laura is actually one of those series that I thought was really, really creepy. I mean, just, just look at her. It's, it's the eyes, I think. But eventually, Laura won me over, and I actually own all of the Laura series. Um, and this one is not going to be any different. Um, I did purchase the whole set as well. So before I go into the options, I just wanted to talk a little bit about Laura. If you're not familiar with Laura, she is a circus clown actually, um, and she has like those star eyes. Like uh, here, let me just bring um, this Laura over. Okay, so she is a circus clown. Um, she uh, performs in front of a lot of audience. She does have this star eyes, like all of the Laura eyes are gonna have stars in them. I know it's probably really creepy while she's staring at you, but I promise after a while, she's gonna win you over too. She's just gonna, you know, look into her eyes and tell her you love her. <laughs> She brings joy to everybody, um, but she does kind of have a sad story, which I guess is why she's a little bit creepy, is um, after she leaves the stage, sometimes she gets really sad. Um, and the only way she gets happy again is by befriending animals and playing with toys. So that is Laura. Here you can stare at her face again. I should probably put a trigger warning for people who are scared of dolls because uh, she's the most doll-like so far. But this is the 200% um, Chardonnay or Green Grape uh, Laura. So um, that's Laura's story. Okay, don't worry. Laura is back to her little corner over there. But now let's take a look at the newest series um, from this set, Laura No Fairy Tales. So these are gonna be the options. As you can see here, there's nine options. They are all fairy tale themed. Um, there's nine designs and two hidden editions. One is a small hidden and a big hidden. So um, let's go ahead and open these up. I do want the whole thing. I do want both the secrets too, but oh my gosh, I, I don't know if we're gonna get any. So let's start with box number one. Um, a lot of people love the white moth or the queen, um, but I do just I have no preference really. I just want all of them. And a secret won't hurt either, so of course I'm going to want a secret. First one is Alice. So this is Alice. All Laura's come with a stand, by the way. And if you can see here, you'll see that it does say like Laura and then what the series name is. So all the stands um, do say this. I'm not going to show every stand for every single one, um, but you'll notice that it'll be put on there. So, I mean, even the big Laura has, um, this is from the Fashion Fruit series and it says Fashion Fruit in there. So um, all of the Laura's do have them. So let's take a look at Alice real quick. Uh, Laura is just very, very detailed and the quality is really good. So you see here that Alice is holding two rabbits. The hair is super cute with a blue bandana, um, the stripe leggings, and everything here is just gorgeous. And this is her card. So it says Alice on there. And this one says Sad Clown all around. I don't know if all of them will have it. And then the QR code and it says Laura No Fairy Tales and the maker Toy City right there. So this is our card and this is our figure. Let's open the next one. They're not very heavy actually. Like this whole set is not heavy at all. Let's see here. Oh, okay, there's extra plastics in here, the stand. And let's see, this one is, this one is the Big Bad Wolf and I now know why it came with that extra plastic. It's because this whole cape, this white cape is uh, flocked. So it's easily uh, dirtied, so I see why. Um, and this is the card for Big Bad Wolf and it does say like sad clown all throughout the card. Moving on to the next one. Ooh, 
Okay, this one's a little bit heftier. This may be the pumpkin because it's a little bit rounder. Let's see if I'm right. Nope, I am not right. <laughs> this one is going to be... Okay, this is one of the most wanted ones. Oh my gosh, her horns, I almost like ripped it off. So this one is going to be the White Moth Queen. So her horns are not flocked, but look at the sleeves. They're so cute. Oh, they're not sleeves. They're like um, gloves, like fingerless gloves. And then she does, she has no shoes. She has like dirty feet. <laughs> Love that for her. And then a uh, almost see-through cape. She is so cute. Her face is just so adorable. The makeup is done so, so well. Um, look at that. It's just so pretty. The lipstick. Oh, I love Laura. I know you're slowly falling in love with Laura too, even if you find her a little bit creepy. So this is our figure, the White Moth Queen, and this is our card. On to the next. I usually have really good luck with getting secrets from the Laura series, but I don't know. I may have just jinxed myself now. Oh, this one. Oh, this one has accessories. It has an umbrella. Which one has an umbrella? Oh, for a second I thought I got a secret, so that's why I paused for a little bit. So this one is called the Witch Crow. So she does have accessories. Let me get her accessories and then we'll talk about her. So this is the Witch Crow with her accessories. So right here, we do have her umbrella and it's kind of leaning. It, there is, um, it is connected to her hand. Um, and then we do have this crow with a top hat. I love her monocle. Um, I love this outfit too. It's very cute, very goth-like. So this is um, the witch crow and this is our card. All right, so we have four more boxes left. I'm getting really nervous because I don't know, I really want the secret. Okay, let's see this one. Okay, this is the, oh my gosh, she's so pretty. This one is the Queen of Hearts. So this is so cute, oh my gosh. Her hair is red roses. So her hair is red roses. She has a tiara. She has like a cat. Her outfit is so cute. This is like almost see-through as well. So this is the Queen of Hearts and this is her card. All right, next try. Oh, it has a beak. So this one's going to be the Cinderella. Let's see. Yep, this is the Cinderella. Look at her. Oh my gosh, her socks are like this yellow gold. Her shoes are that Cinderella blue. Oh, her face is so pretty. Say what you will about Laura and how creepy she can be, but her face is just always so pretty. Like, oh, I love it. Her dress is super cute. Let's go ahead and put her accessories on her. So here is our Laura, um, our Cinderella Laura, and then her accessory is this bill or beak, and it is magnetized, so it just kind of goes on there, which is so cute. Oh my gosh. And then this is her card, our Cinderella Laura. This is looking real goth over there, so let's see what her next one's going to be. Ooh, kind of real packed in here. I see a pumpkin. I think we have the pumpkin. The pumpkin is so cute. So I am excited to unbox this pumpkin. There she is. This one is called pumpkin head. I wonder why, <laughs> but the pumpkin is see-through. You really can't take the pumpkin out. I don't think so. Maybe you can, but I'm not going to try because I'm kind of scared. <gasps> oh my gosh. I just noticed that in the back of her head. Oh my gosh, this is just getting better and better. Should I try to open it? No, I don't want to break it. I don't I don't think it opens, but that's Voldemort right there. That is so creepy. That is like Voldemort right there. 
so cute though this Laura so let's go ahead and put her um, accessories on her so let's take a closer look at her so she's wearing like these sandals with socks a cape a polka dot shirt she does have like this uh, pumpkin basket and then a star wand she also has a hat which is so cute this is her whole vibe right here so ooh, but this one's like not magnetized or anything so I don't really know how I can show it with it staying on because this pumpkin head's pretty round. Ooh, there we go, maybe. Ta-da, okay. So <laughs> that is her with her card, the pumpkin head. I love this one, they really- Voldemort. They really did the most with this one. All right, two more left, let's see. Ooh. Stand, and I think this is our Red Riding Hood. Yep, that's what she is. This is our Little Red Riding Hood. Um, pretty classic outfit if you ask me. Super cute, super detailed. Let's go ahead and put her on our stand. This is Little Red Riding Hood and this is her card. There she is. Super adorable. Last one, it's either the Scarecrow or the Secrets, but let's be real, it's more than likely the Scarecrow. I doubt they're going to switch the Scarecrow with any of the Secrets. If anything, it would be those um, queens because they're the most popular. And here we have, oh my god, look who's right, it is me. It's the Scarecrow. <laughs> she is really cute though, so I'm not even mad at it. Like just very detailed so super cute so this is our scarecrow figure and this is our card so this is the last one that we have so this is the full set of our laura no fairy tales we did not get a secret because of course i jinxed myself since i said i always have good luck um but if you want to compare the size the 200 percent laura is of course going to be double the regular figures as you can see here um i hope you guys had as much fun as i did unboxing this and i'll see you on the next one bye mm -hmm.